A local organization held a golf tournament this morning to benefit children who are diagnosed with cancer. As 13's Brent Palmer reports, this golf tournament means a lot to many local families. Yes, Callie. The ninth annual Team Blake Golf Tournament kicked off this morning, giving attendees a good time for a good cause. 280 people gathered for an important golf tournament Sunday morning with a long nine-year history. Our son was diagnosed with a rare leukemia at the age of one, and we had family and friends put on a golf event for us to try to raise funds to help pay for medical bills, and um, we just had this overwhelming support from our community. Even though their son Blake passed away, the Kaziers hold this fundraising golf tournament each year through the Team Blake Foundation. It's fun. We've been coming to this event for a number of years and it's it's awesome just to see the amount of support and this this tournament gets bigger and bigger each year and we always encourage friends of ours that were um, not able to make it out if they haven't heard about it. We always encourage them to come out and be a part of it because it's unlike any other fundraising tournament you'll experience. This exciting event also included a golf ball cannon on one of the holes and a silent auction. All the funds go to support northeastern Kansas families battling cancer. It's like Jacqueline has said, uh, by other people supporting her, she was able to spend every moment that she could with Blake. And so that's what they're doing is they're in turn giving it back to local families so that they can spend every waking moment with their child that's fighting cancer. The event always impacts Jacqueline as it shows the best of the Topekan community. I am overwhelmed with tears of joy that all these people come out and they believe in what we do and um, they are giving to these kids that need and they're also playing in memory of our son Blake so I am overjoyed. If you want to learn more about the Team Blake Foundation or are interested in giving we will have a link to their website on WIBW.com. Brent thanks. I